I just thought I'd make a real quick video to show you a problem that I encountered on a 2008 BMW 335i two-door coupe. The issue is the vehicle came in with a severe misfire on cylinders one, two, and three, as you can see by the uh, trouble codes on this screenshot. And uh, the highlighted trouble code is the one that concerns me the most. It's uh, 0030BA, which says injectors one, two, and three, or DME, which is digital motor electronics, internal fault, the ECU or ECM. So I'll show you how I proceeded, how I did things, and hopefully this may help some people in the future. Okay, so I've already diagnosed the issue to some bad injectors, and I'm just gonna show you how I like to test the injector. So what I do is I take, so there's no room for mistake, I actually take a connector, uh, one for each terminal, put it into the injector. This is, happens to be cylinder one. Put the ohm meter on the 2000 ohm scale. And when we test it, as you can see, it's testing open, open circuit. Now, here we have the replacement injector. Same part number, just a different index number, which I'll get into a little bit later. And same thing, just to show you the difference between the two. Here we go. We're going to plug that. Plug that. And we'll And as you can see, it's showing inwards of around 193 to 195, 196. BMW spec calls for 200 plus or minus 40 ohms. So at 190, 195, we're right on spec. And it also has to do with the ambient temperature in the room, which will change the resistance somewhat. So now another note, what we have here are the exact same part numbers, but different index numbers. So you see here, one is index 04, the other one is index 08. BMW states that you can use in the same motor any injector of index 10 and below and injector index of 11 and above. You can't combine the two. So you can use a 4 with an 8, but you can't use an 8 with an 11 or a 4 with an 11 or an 8 with a 12 or vice versa. Another area of note are these numbers here. These numbers are the calibration numbers which need to be entered into the BMW DME, Digital Motor Electronics, or ECU, Engine Control Unit. These are what calibrate the computer to run with the injectors. If you do not do this procedure, the motor will run rough and use too much fuel. After you've replaced the injectors, you go into service functions, program or calibrate injectors, and enter each number that would correspond with the injector. So if the just injector is in cylinder one, you would enter this number under cylinder one. If this injector is in cylinder two, you would enter this number into cylinder two, and so forth for three, four, five, and six. Sometimes the DME will take that number, make its own calibration, and change the number somewhat, but, but rest assured it's done its job. When you're finished, hit program and the car should run well, unless you have the code like we have 0030BA. So, we have the injector disconnected. Thankfully, somebody, not myself, because I do not work that way, has already skinned the wires, and this car came to me in pieces to begin with. So, somebody has been having problems, weren't able to figure out what it was. So, here we are. We see that the injector is firing, we're getting current. So, why? And we plug it in. Does it run worse? And. No signal. The signal fades out. Why would that be?
as the car came to me in pieces, it was quite easy to remove the uh, the DME. As you can see, this one here is MSD80. Again, that's MSD80. And uh, I checked all the wiring from the injectors directly to the harness to the DME. All is good. So I figure I'd check the injector drivers or MOSFETs, MOSFET transistors. And here we have them. So as you can see, we have the six injectors there. We're going to test each one because I have a suspicion that uh, the number one injector or number one MOSFET for the number one injector will be defective. So uh, although I'm not quite sure of the order, I believe it's uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. But I'm not 100 percent sure of the order. So here we'll start down here. And uh, as you can see, it, these are actually act as switches, which allow current to be switched to and from the injector and they should be open which as you can see by the meter they are and then as we 